Hey guys and welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be playing Lothal, a semi brand new horror game on Steam. I don't know anything about it, but I did see it on YouTube, so I thought I'd give it a try. Alright, so we have new game, let's do that. So before I read, I just want to point out the fact that there's a little hand cursor on my screen, but you guys can't see it for some reason. Anyway. Today marks your first day at Neural Set Solutions, a pioneering company at the forefront of technology innovation. Specializing in cutting edge technologies, they have recently announced the development of a groundbreaking virtual reality experience set to redefine leisure and entertainment. Envision immersed vacations from the comfort of your home, where every sensation feels real and every adventure awaits. As you step into their office today, you're stepping into the future. Since it's your first day, you will have the opportunity to try out a demo of the virtual reality experience in advance, allowing you to familiarize yourself with technology you'll be working with in the future. Thank you for jo joining Neural Net Solutions and let the adventure begin. I barely messed it up. I'm so good at reading. I actively struggled, but that's okay. What is that? It looks like a pill. Oh, we're going in that. I don't think this is safe. Why is there no technology, like, in it? It's just a pod. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me... It reminds me of that one anime. I don't remember what it's called. But it was like a virtual... I'm pretty sure... I'm like 90% sure that it was Sword Art Online. Um, because it's like the virtual reality world where you die in game, you die in life. Like, real life. Reminds me of that. Okay. Well... Hello, recruit. Welcome to Neural Net Solutions Virtual World. Before we get you started on your assignments, here's a short tutorial on what you can do inside the virtual simulation. You can press E to interact with doors. I pressed R. Oh my. You can also pick up objects like this key by pressing the same button. Okay. <gasps> key. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. It's WASD again, everybody. My worst and oh, oh my God! I'm using arrow keys. I love this game. Oh my God! I love this game so much. Oh I'm so happy. I'm literally is that. Tick? You're not gonna s oogie boogie me, are you? Oh, it wants me to click this. Okay. Wait, is this a ride? Oh, oh, oh. Minecraft textures. What does it want me looking at? Welcome, dear oh, friends, okay. to the heart of Neural Net Solutions. Within these walls of innovation and possibility, you found not just a workplace, but a gateway to boundless opportunity. Your presence here is more than a mere step. It's a leap into a future where dreams meet reality. We extend our heartfelt thanks for choosing to embark on this extraordinary journey alongside us. Extraordinary? Your inaugural day at Neural Net Solutions will be dedicated to immersing yourself within the tapestry of experiences we create. Okay. Today, allow us to unveil a glimpse of what awaits you within our spectacular virtual vacation resort. You call this a vacation? Step inside one of our virtual reality modules and discover a new world where you can explore, indulge, and savor these introductory adventures. I thought it doesn't seem good. These carefully designed moments <laughs> offer a taste of the canvas that you'll help paint in the days ahead. And remember, should you encounter anything noteworthy or wish to share your insights, our dedicated staff is always at your service. Are these players or are they just mannequins to make us feel like there's other people? None of this breathtaking journey would have been possible without our dedicated team's relentless pursuit of excellence. 
I'm in a video and at the game. Of our innovation stands M Man, our groundbreaking award winning artificial intelligence. Okay. This state of the art Back intelligence pedal. meticulously constructs and shapes your experience within the simulation. You encounter today will have been made by him specifically for you. you. Okay, but we're in a video game meant to be like happy and nice and nice and stuff like that. So why is it absolutely horrifying off the bat and why does it remind me of Little Big Planet if it was a horror game? I don't like suspicious dark hallways. Death destroyed. Any allegations about disappearances, deaths, or unsettling occurrences within neural net solutions have remained unproven to this day. Mere oh. unfounded and unsubstantiated. But worry not. While M-Man may be in control of your experience, we have added extra security measure to make sure that no harm can come to you while inside the simulation. Uh, how... So Step this is sort of online. Infinite possibilities, whether scaling majestic peaks or diving into uncharted realms. Your journey through Neural Net Solutions virtual vacations begins here. Embrace the future where every adventure is yours to explore. Okay. Um do I get a flashlight maybe? Okay. Oh guys, look it's it's my family. I think they're leaving me. I don't like this. I know it's texture, but what is the white stuff on the wall? Dear worker, welcome to our virtual vacation resort. As a valued member of our testing team, you have a unique opportunity to shape this extraordinary experience. Your expertise and observations are crucial in perfecting this virtual paradise. Please document any glitches or suggestions you encounter during your expeditions. Thank you for being a part of this exciting endeavor. Enjoy unforgettable adventures with our virtual resort. P.S. Attached to this note is a key that grants you access to the elevator. Pick it up after you are done reading this. Regards, Neural Net Solutions Team. Maximilian Boss, COO of NNS. Okay. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, man. I think, like, um... I think you suck at making a virtual world because this sucks. This really sucks. Like, really sucks. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, dude. Okay, I'm not comfortable. Hello, worker. As this is your first day in the company, we want you to experience what we will offer to the public once our virtual vacation resort opens. The testing room contains a teleporter and everything, every time, sorry. We have an activity ready for you. It'll appear in this room form of a floppy disk. Yay! You can insert the floppy disk into the player at the back of the room to start the activity. When you're finished, we'll ask you to fill out a sax saxophone. Satisfaction survey. Best regards. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't care. Okay. So, what I'm getting from this whole entire game is that you want me dead and deceased. Can I go? Oh my god, I'm going to be honest. That scared me. I don't like when doors are locked and they do the little jiggle jiggle. I'm going to be honest. I don't expect any horror to be here yet. I take it back. Give me the floppy disk. Does it have a name on it? I didn't read the name on it. So I have no clue what I just clicked. The escape of a lifetime. Uh huh. I don't feel comfortable. Can I close this door? Relax. Recharge. Rejuvenate. Yay! I'm sorry. Is oh. Okay, we're gonna get massage. Okay. What the? What? What is that? What was that? Was that like a normal? Oh my goodness. Okay. Was that like a normal massage thingy? And I'm just over dramatic, or? Okay. How hard was it for them to make an actually good looking game instead of whatever this is? What horrors this is? What is the bar on the bottom of my screen? How do I use that? Is it like a progression bar or something? Hello, you look like the goddamn medic from Team Fortress 2. You 
really look like medic from Team Fortress 2. Oh my goodness. I already want to press quit. I want to press quit. I want to press escape and then I want to quit the game. That's exactly what I want to do. I hate, hate, hate exploration horror games. Oh, I'm genuinely stupid. I don't like it, I don't like it here, I don't like it here, I don't like it here. Please, hold my hand. I should have called one of my friends. Okay. Why am I just tucked away? Is this where I'm getting my massage? Yeah, this seems like it. You know what? It's, I, I, I no hard feelings. Okay. Oh, disc. Oh. You want to come with me? The music is gone. Fuck that. Get going, get going, get going, get going, get going. Do I have a... Don't tell me I have a fucking... Oh, I have a stamina bar. Okay, that's... That's okay. That's chill. I'm... I'm chill with that. I'm not shaking in my boots. I'm not shaking in my boots. I need to calm down and let my stamina feel good god. Okay. Before we enter this room- Oh, it's a shower. It's a shower. Okay. That means nothing bad happens when you're in the shower. Just can't drop the soap. Don't drop the soap. Ah, Jesus, man, medic. Hey, man, you want a kiss? I'm gonna take a piss. That's how I take a piss, guys. You want me to go down here? Okay. I don't like this game. That doesn't scream run for your life. Is that Freddy Fazbear's hat? I think I'm safe. That's that that said that said to for your life. That said to for your life. What the fuck? What the fuck? No! That said, let me in! Holy shit, fucking! Oh, I didn't like that. I didn't like that. I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. Okay. Finishing this video today. You know what? All I care about is us getting to a save point. That's all I care about. That is all I care about. Us getting to a save point. Oh, did I just enter bloody? You know what I'm thinking of. Message. We may be currently experiencing issues that we are unable to connect to you at this time. We are both ah, my balls. Our team working tirelessly to identify the issue. We once again want to thank you for your valuable contribution to our testing efforts. Let that door open. Whoa, hello. Hi. Okay. Um, this reminds me of a funny little game called. Lethal Company. 
The only difference is Lethal Company is funny. This game wants me to cry. This game wants me to cry. I want to get to a save point, please. Is there a... Oh my god, please don't tell me. I'm pretty sure I have to be a whole entire level. Like, there's not gonna be, like, little save points to keep me from absolutely being distressed and crying. Like, I have to, like, continuously play the game. I don't have a lot of CDs, so... Don't open that goddamn door! What is wrong with you? I don't like it in there. Is this a... You're fine, you're fine. Just sit in a corner, just sit in a corner. Okay, there, there we, there we. Why do I play horror games as a goddamn living? The choosing vacation resort virtual world N six five one A number nineteen. A critical issue has recently emerged in one of our virtual vacation resort areas. The situation has escalated beyond previous occurrences in terms of both frequency and the severity of glitches, which is a cause for concern. While it is not uncommon, uncommon for minor glitches to occur in virtual environments, the current situation remains immediate action due to the severe corruption. Swift AI adjustments are necessary to resort normal operation. Approved? Yes. Okay. That was approved? I feel like I'm going to touch something. Bad happens. Press escape to view map. What does this mean? So wait a second. Wait a second. Is there something that needs to be set off here? I'm gonna have to split this video up into two sections. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna save my stamina. Go, bro. Go, bro. Googly, googly, goo. So we are now over here, which seems like a good thing. Like, we're supposed to be here. I spent 15 fucking dollars on this. I spent 15 fucking dollars on this game. I can't just drop the game. I literally can't just drop the game. A 
as much as I want to stop playing and like never touch the game ever again, I can't do that because I spent $15 on it. What does this game want from me? Okay, so... It says there's something to touch over here. What am I supposed to do with that information? Because the red, the red thingy is I can touch them, but I don't know which one to touch first. Like, there has to be a pattern. Don't do this. My mouse is breaking again. So there's like something in the rooms, right? Okay, so I'm autistic. That's what I am. You're fucked, big guy. You are fucked. I have to grab the painting. Where did I put it? So I think I know what I'm doing now. I literally- I- This is the first time I haven't googled how to do anything. This is like the first time that I'm saying, fuck it, we ball. So if we put it here, that unlocked. I'm a genius. This is a painting of despair because it sure feels like it. So if I grab both paintings, but hold on, no, there was something else. Right, there was like something else. Or am I tripping? It's like other ways to do it. Okay. So it's like telling me other ways that I could have done it. Okay. I think at least. Because why would this need to be unlocked? Because there's nothing in here. You know what? The minute that we get to a save checkpoint, I'm going to stop gaming. Because there's uh, levels, I'm pretty sure, of this. How am I supposed to feel good about my plan, even though I very much know there's going to be a chasing here? Flowers, you're chasing. I'm so ready to get the fuck out of here. Where are the horrors? Outstanding work, esteemed team member. To continue with your vital contributions, please grab the next floppy disk. Nothing bad happened. Nothing bad happened. You know, I'm saving the game. Actually, I just realized I still have a key, and I don't know where the key leads to... Has he always been there? Has that guy- Am I stuck? Has that guy always been there? And my mouse is broken again. Alright, so this is where I'm leaving the game off for episode one, apparently. Um. Oh, it's a medic! Hi, medic! Yeah! 
so that's where I'm leaving off the first episode of this horror game. Um, I don't know how many more levels there are, but I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, like and subscribe.